This afternoon, cleanup efforts are continuing in the Monterey County community of Pajaro. It has been nearly three weeks now since a levee burst there, forcing that entire town to evacuate. Today, though, the city opened, the county rather, opened a resource center to help residents and businesses pick up the pieces. KP's Mark Sayre, live for us now in Pajaro with a look at how things are going. Mark. Well, Heather, we've had some of that heavy rain and hail here in Pajaro this afternoon, which of course is not helpful to the overall cleanup effort. The good news is the sewer system here has been restored, but the water is still not safe to drink, and residents here are trying to get help any way they can. This is what it looks like inside the Mexico Meat Market, a store which has stood for 40 years at the foot of the Main Street Bridge, linking Pajaro with Watsonville. Not everything we clean the kitchen. Owner Maria Martinez hopes to have a small section of the store reopened in perhaps a week, but the full project could take months. So she came to the resource center that Monterey County has set up at the Veterans Memorial Hall in Watsonville. You're a business owner. What kind of help do you need the most? The most we need help because we need to pay the mortgage and uh, we don't have no income. This is our only income, the business. So the fact that the county set up this place for you to come and talk to all these different people, is that helpful to you? It is helpful. This resource center was very busy on the first day it was open, bringing together state and local resources from housing to financial aid to agricultural assistance, as well as tax and health officials and even the Mexican consulate. The idea is to get as much help as possible, as simply as possible, to the people who need it the most. We're also providing transportation for residents to come to this area. And the reason for this is to bring some of the resources that they're going to need to mitigate some of the issues that they've been finding now that they are back at their uh, at their residences. More than 2,000 residents here were evacuated in the middle of the night nearly three weeks ago when the levee protecting the town from the Pajaro River burst. Trucks carrying thousands of gallons of fresh water have been brought in, and people are bringing their own containers to fill so they can stay in their homes and have water for drinking. It could be several more weeks before the water is safe here. And the magnitude of the cleanup effort cannot be overstated. Drive down just about any residential street, and the contents from entire houses and apartments are out on the sidewalks, being ready to be hauled away. Back at the resource center, residents say every bit helps. All the furniture, bed, uh, sofa. All stroke, destroyed? All, the, all destroyed. Now, about an hour from now, California's lieutenant governor will be here to survey the damage. Of course, all eyes also on Washington, D.C., where California's entire congressional de delegation has asked President Biden to approve emergency uh, declaration aid for Monterey County and uh, all of the other counties in California, which have been severely affected by all of these recent storms. Reporting live in Pajaro in Monterey County, I'm Mark Sayer, KTVU Fox 2 News.